On the 15th anniversary of the 2006 shooting at Dawson College, a group representing survivors of the attack and their families is urging voters not to vote for the federal conservatives. For the last decade and a half, a small group of those directly affected by the Dawson School shooting have been advocating to change the law that allowed a troubled and angry young man to have legal access to weapons that enable mass shootings. Kathleen Dixon, who witnessed the shooting and whose daughter Morgan survived being shot, said in a statement made public Monday. The group says that they are urging Canadians to think twice about what government they want to make decisions about their safety when they vote in the federal elections. Noting that the Dawson killer was the legal owner of a legal Beretta CX-4 Storm with a legal 10-bullet magazine and a legal handgun. Both of which were used to shoot 20 people, including 18-year-old Anastasia de Souza, who died in the attack. Saying that this election will decide all, the group is calling upon electors not vote conservative. We need you to vote liberal or, if you live in Quebec, to vote liberal or block Quebecois. The statement quotes Hader Kadeheem, a survivor of the attack, as saying a vote for the Conservative Party is a vote for the gun lobby. Everything this party has done since the shooting at my school has been at the behest of the gun lobby. In fact, Aaron O'Toole owes them his ascension to the party's leadership. If the Conservatives get elected, it'll be payback time. If you don't want the gun lobby hijacking our laws like they do in the United States, then please don't vote for the party that is beholden to the gun lobby. Monday's statement was issued as the Conservatives find themselves on the defensive over the issue of gun control, with opponents citing the party's platform, which has since been amended. The previous version included a plan to rescind the federal regulation outlawing certain types of assault-style weapons. The statement notes that Bisouza's family wished to spend this anniversary in private. While she did not recommend one federal party over another, Montreal Mayor Valerie Plan also observed the sad anniversary of the Dawson attack on her Twitter account and called upon all parties running the campaign to make gun control a priority. Subscribe now for more updates.